Morgan, 1870 to 1942, was credited for creating the game of volleyball as a combination of four sports basketball, baseball, tennis, and handball. At the time, Morgan was an instructor at the Young Men's Christian Association, which we know as the YMCA, and was looking to develop an activity which had less physical contact than basketball, that he could teach his classes of businessmen, which were older gentlemen who preferred to play a sport with less physical contact. 1896, Springfield College, formerly the International YMCA Training School, was the site of the first official game of volleyball. One observer after watching the ball volley back and forth over the net, suggested the name of the sport should be called volleyball. 1900, a special ball was designed that was spherical and made of leather and sometimes plastic for the sport. Volleyball is a high-energy team sport played by two teams of six players separated by a net. The sport was originated in 1895 in Holyoke, Massachusetts, by William G. Morgan, a physical education director of YM. He named the sport Mignonet, which was played as a pastime by any number of players. After its first exhibition match held in 1896, it was named as volleyball by an observer Alfred Halstead. The first world championship for men was held in 1949 and in 1952 for women. The sport is also a part of Summer Olympics since 1964. The International Federation of the Sport FIVB was founded in 1947. It was structured as an indoor game for representatives who found the new sport of basketball excessively vivacious. He called the game Mignonette until an educator from Springfield College in Massachusetts saw the volleying thought of play, and proposed the name of volleyball. 